and here they are. So let's go back to now the primary key. The primary key, and by the way, these are rules that the developer of a database, a relational database, should be validating. These are components of the primary key that should be double checked before the record is ever allowed to, to be entered. This uh, validation check is referred to as the entity integrity validation for a primary key. Two checks. The first check says, if you're going to build a row in a table, it must have a primary key. You can't have an empty primary key and have a row that exists. Second thing is, that primary key for that record must be unique in that table. In other words, I can't reuse that same value in multiple records. So those are two entity integrity validation checks for primary keys. Now when I use that primary key in a foreign table, it becomes a foreign key in that second table. And for foreign keys, we have another validation that we need to check, and that's referred to as referential integrity. If I generate a foreign key down here, which links it to a primary key in another table, that value must exist as a primary key in the other table. It cannot be linked to a null field. So that is referred to as the referential integrity validation check for foreign keys.